Hey fellow crypto enthusiast, welcome to today's quick trend analysis. Let's get straight to it. In this video you will see in which direction the price of Bitcoin has moved recently. Additionally, you will find out what the technical indicators RSI, divergence, stochastic RSI and MACD are predicting about its price and future movements. If you are not familiar with the indicators, check out the explanation videos down below in the description. By looking at the hourly time frame for Bitcoin, we can see that the price moved up quickly with around 4.8% in the last 24 hours, with a current price of 43,688. We can see that the buyers are taking over because the volume was also high, showing that this move was strong. Jumping to the hourly relative strength index, the current hourly RSI of 66 is located in the upper region, meaning that the price is being overbought and we can expect a comeback or for the price to remain on track for some time. Searching for divergence in the hourly time frame, there was a bearish divergence and the price already went down. Looking at the hourly stochastic RSI, both the percent %K and percent %D lines are in the lower region, which means that the price is getting oversold and soon a trend change or at least some kind of consolidation could be expected. You should wait to see if there will be an upward trend to the crypto because the K line has not yet crossed the D line. Moving to the hourly MACD, the trend is currently going down because the MACD line is below the signal line. We can expect for the price to continue going down or perhaps remain at least stable because the MACD histogram shows the momentum currently being strong. Looking at the 3 hourly relative strength index, the current 3 hourly RSI of 78 is overly high which means that the price is extremely overbought and a rebound or some kind of consolidation is to be expected. Looking at the 3 hourly stochastic RSI, the stochastic RSI currently shows no overbought or oversold conditions, but the percent %K line is below the percent %D line, which means the current trend is on the downside. Jumping to the 3 hourly MACD, seeing as the MACD line is above the signal line, meaning that the trend is currently on the up. But according to the MACD histogram, we can see that the momentum is going down. Owing to this we can expect the price to remain stable and you should wait and see if the MACD line will cross the signal line, which will be a downward trend. In general, the larger time frames have a greater impact on the price, so please remember that when we display different time frames with different indicators. And also the shorter time frames are only representative for the short term trading. Thanks for watching and know that every few hours new videos are uploaded analyzing different cryptocurrencies, so be sure to hit subscribe and not miss out. If you have any questions, leave a comment below and we'll get back to you ASAP. Also, keep in mind that you should make your own investment decisions as cryptocurrency trading is very risky and these daily videos only an overview of trends and are a purely technical analysis without considering the fundamentals. See you next time.